Hello, hello, my name is Pixelated Twix and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age Origins. Glad to see you guys back. Hope you're enjoying yourselves. I'm, I'm really ready to get back into this game. Um, I had some thoughts about the quest line and I hope you guys saw that episode um, and or just saw that video maybe and I would love to hear from you what your opinion is. Well, Goldana, I did get a um, comment that Goldana, I think, was mentioned in, I don't know if it was a comic book or it was a, uh, some kind of lore book that was written. So I am kind of curious to see what that's about. As you say. Anyways, let's get on with it. We're going to, we're back in the mm -hmm. Temple of Andraste. I think this is, is this the Temple of Andraste? I don't know. This is a temple. And uh, yeah, so let's get going. Let's let's hit it. It's a trap. Where? Oh. Look there, a cunning trap. Oh, we got a big mage up here. Big mage, big mage. No whammies. And okay. 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 When? When? Okay. okay, we're dead. We're so dead. We're so dead. We are so dead. All right, I'm coming, Alistair. Alistair! Yep, it's just me. I don't see me surviving this. I'm sorry. Well, we started off great, absolutely great. Okay, so maybe, maybe, maybe we should rethink this whole, whole. Okay, yeah. Started off lovely. I really should have brought in another mage. Can't change the party now. All right, let's proceed. Let's see what we can do here. What do we have? Liliana. Um, let me do this. Liliana, I need you to actually switch over to your... Okay, you are in your mains. Yeah, but I think you're switching over. Either way, let's go. Maybe we should come back. Yeah, this is what we're gonna do. All right. It shall be done. Okay, I think that worked out in our favor. So now we've got to aggro these guys. Bring them back this way. Come on, guys. No, 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 no. Okay. Bring him back here. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now. It's a trap. Up here. Let's get these drakes down. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh dear. It's that. It is that. Win, help me out, dear. Help me out. Oh, 
Get, get Alistair. Okay. Enough. Alistair's dead. Alistair's dead. Careful. I am. It shall be done. Jeez. As oh say. my goodness. That was crazy. All right, where is everyone? Are they all dead up here? Yeah. Sorry about that, guys. Spellweaver. Ooh, this is for an arcane warrior. Wait, do we have an arcane warrior? I don't think so. Who can be one? Or I guess that would be if I were a mage or something like that. Some more Drake scales. All right. Grab these. Um. Oh. Very well. Let's save this. <laughs> yeah, let's save this. Um. Actually, Alistair leveled up. Let's give him. Well. Yeah. Hmm. 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 Alistair, let's level you up, honey. Give you some more constitution. Also, more strength, because I really want to get that const. Oh. I, I think I need to get cunning up. That's right. Um. Yeah, I need to work on his cunning. Death blow. Yeah, let's give him that. Uh, what am I missing? Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm just gonna keep that one for now. Um. Where am I supposed to be going here? I guess this way. Is there anything else? Nope. Looks like that's it. We're definitely going up. Alistair made mention of that last time. Felt like we were going uphill. We're definitely going uphill. Oh shoot. Here we go again. What's with all the dang drakes? Okay, we've had enough of these, uh, these mages. Get these mages. Get these mages. Oops. Okay. I am exhausted. Very well. Ah! We did it. Oh, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't see her. I didn't see her. Okay. It shall be done. All right, who? You guys like your drakes? Look at all these eggs. There's an egg here. Heavy metal shield, life drinker, restriction, blood mage. Do we have a blood mage? So can... I could see Morgan being a blood mage. New Codex, First Light, Chapter 3. I'm not going to do a whole lot of reading this time. Let's get Liliana leveled up. Give her a little more constitution. Also, um, some more cunning, perhaps. Do I want to get her lock picking up? I guess I should probably give her some more. Um, some more me melee. Because she does tend to switch back and forth. Yeah, so let's do that. Um, okay. And where do we go? I guess back out this way. I didn't see another place to go, so. Mm. We shall see. All right, so we came from this way. I didn't see another way. So do we, 
Oh, wait. Okay, so we have to go back down this way, I think. Because there was another path. Was there? See, now it's been like a couple days since I've played, so I'm struggling already. All right. Um. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I think is this the right? Let me look. No, this has to be it, right? See now, there's. Oh, what the heck? Oh wait, that's right. This is the way. Okay. Yeah. This is the way. Um. I hope it is. Look at that. Look at the detail and like, it looks like it's smoky or like, cause I would assume it would be hot down here because of the, the dragons maybe, or the drakes. The detail in this game. It's it it's an old game, but it still amazes me. Um yeah, look at the lighting. Oh my gosh. Okay. Can't get over that. Old as this game is. The lighting is fantastic. Oh sugar, I didn't see that. Can I please let me be able to Alistair. Oh no no. Get get the get the mage. 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 Did she? What? Okay. Oh. Bad day, huh? Bad day. Will you guys quit writing into the traps, please, 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 everyone? Just calm down. Stop running into the traps. Thank you very much. Leather. Fancy vase. All right. Should we save or should we let it go? Let's just let it go for now. No, 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 no. I say that and then the game crashes. I die. Gotta start over. Not a good look. Let's just throw caution to the wind. Maybe not throw caution to the wind. Let's be cautious. Yes. Okay, I don't see any traps. Well, hello there. What's his name? Stop! You will go no further. This is Sparta. <laughs> it looks like looks like Gerald Butler. I'm sorry, Gerald Butler. He looks. <laughs> he looks like. I'm sorry. Okay. He just had a beard. He he looked okay. Yeah. Oh oh, is is that so? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? You do not have the right to demand my name. You have defiled our temple. You have spilled the blood of the faithful and slaughtered our young. No more. You will tell me now, intruder, why you have done all this. Why have you come here? Buttons. What is your occupation? <laughs> um. Um, I've come to make sure you never hurt anyone again. I've come for the Earth of Sacred Ashes. Tell me your name and I will tell you why I'm here. I am Father Colgrim, leader and guide to the disciples of Andraste. Kill us and you will face Andraste. She will smell our blood and the blood of her children on you and her wrath will be great. Ah. Uh. What are you talking about? The prophet Andraste has overcome death itself and has returned to her faithful in a form more radiant than you can imagine. Not even the Tevinter Imperium could hope to slay her now. What hope do you have? He'd be cute if he wasn't crazy. Um, yes, you're mad Andraste is dead. I wish to see this origin Andraste. 
And what has happened to the ashes? Will you accept an apology then? Um, you're mad. Andraste's dead. You know nothing! Andraste revealed herself to us! We are her chosen! To arms, my brethren! Andraste will grant us oh. victory! We fight! Get the, get the mages. Get the mages. You, we know the drill. Get the mages. Oh, gosh. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay. Liliana, it's up to you, girl. Get the mages. Oh, I'm dead. Alistair's dead. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna need you to stop freezing me. Win. Heal. <laughs> You'll win. I shall. I'll do it. You should run while you can. He should. Yes. I thought it was over. I thought it was. Very well. All right. What did what did um Gerald leave us? Ooh, Colgrim's horn. This horn is emblazoned with a modified chantry symbol. Belonged to Father Colgrim of Haven when he wished to commune with the high dragon that he believed to be Andraste reborn. This horn will sound will sound out from the mountaintop. We're taking it, Faith Sedge. This is a two-handed battle axe. I guess we can give this to um to Sten. Um, all right, let's grab this. I'm gonna save it here. Uh, okay, I guess we go this way. Ooh. A high dragon is not a joke. We best be careful. Real careful. It's fine. I don't, I don't have any issue with leaving the high dragon alone like yeah i'm not touching that i'm not touching that absolutely not so let's see that's some stuff and things oh what is over here is there anything no is there wait no okay just out of curiosity see if there's anything of interest we got some stuff over here to loot Uh, not much of interest. Some fire arrows. Definitely can use that for Liliana. Should probably see if Liliana needs to be outfitted with arrows. Still having regrets about maybe not bringing um, Morgan, but I think I think Wynn and Liliana are really f suited. For this, also Alistair, all of them have some kind of experience with the the Chantry. When, of course, being a Circle Mage, Liliana being a Chloris, I guess she was in the Cloister. Alistair, of course, being a Templar, former Templar. All right, what do we got? Hello, Guardian. Be with you in just a moment. Gonna loot Andraste's arrows. The like begun. extra holy arrows. Anything else? It's a book over here. I guess we'll get that. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I guess not. I bid you welcome, Pilgrim. Um, hello. Who are you? I am the Guardian, the protector of the urn of sacred ashes. 
I have waited years for this. Okay. Um. Why have you been here so long? It has been my duty, my life, to protect the urn and prepare the way for the faithful. Mm -hmm. Come to revere Andraste. For years beyond counting have I been here. And shall I remain until my task is done and the Imperium has crumbled into the sea? Um... The Imperium is no longer as powerful as it once was, that's true. Ah, is it not? Well... Then perhaps this is the beginning of the end. Who are the men who have taken over the rest of the temple? When my brethren and I carried Andraste from Tevinter to this sanctuary, we vowed to forever revere her memory and guard her. I have watched generations of my brethren take up the mantle of their fathers. For centuries they did this, unwavering, joyful in their appointed task. But now they have lost their way. They have forgotten Andraste and their promise. What about you? Who are you? I am all that remains of the first disciples. I swore I would protect the urn as long as I lived. And I have lived a very long time. The first of the disciples? Did you know Andraste? Did anyone really know her, save the Maker? She would sometimes spend weeks alone in meditation, often without food or water. Hmm, okay. How is it possible that you have lived for so long? I would say that... I don't know. Let me ask that question. I made a vow to Andraste and to the Maker. My life is tied to the ashes. As long as they remain, so will I. I see. What can you tell me about the Urn of Sacred Ashes? You already know that the urn contains the remains of the Prophet Andraste. Yes. What else is there to tell? Um... The dragon is not really Andraste, is she? I, I mean, she kind of knows that. These people are fanatics. There's... Yeah. I'm not going to ask that. All right, what do you know about these disciples of Andraste? Let's not waste time. How do I get to the urn? Ugh, I don't like that choice, but... You have come to honor Andraste. And you shall. Okay. If you prove yourself worthy. And how do I do that? I need the ashes to cure a noble man. Still... You must prove yourself worthy. Okay. It is not my place to decide your worthiness. The gauntlet does that. If you are found worthy, you will see the urn and be allowed to take a small pinch of the ashes for yourself. If not... You have chosen poorly. Um, all right. Um, hmm. What is the gauntlet? The gauntlet tells the true pilgrims from the false. You will undergo four tests of faith, and we shall see how your soul fares. The steps of a penitent man? All right, let's see. Tell you, can you tell me anything about anything else about this gauntlet? You will understand what it is when you face it. Okay, very well. Uh, I will enter the gauntlet. Before you go, there is something I must ask. I see that the path that led you here was not easy. There is suffering in your past. Your suffering, and the suffering of others. You abandoned your father and mother, leaving them in the hands of Rendon Howe, 
Knowing he would show no mercy, do you think you failed your parents? Oh gosh, um... Hmm, I don't know if I like know they made me go. I feel as... I feel like Natalia would have wanted to defend them to the death. But at the same time, she knows that the lineage must go on. The Kuslin lineage, granted, lineages usually um, continue through the sun. And But Fergus, she didn't know if Fergus was alive or not. And if he would survive the blight, if he was. So still, she wasn't willing to go to go with um, Duncan. So she knew that her father was going to pass. I guess I should have insisted that my mother come with me. But would her mother have survived all this way? I don't know. I guess that's kind of a hard... Um, no, I had to survive to tell Fergus that we were betrayed. I should have insisted that my mother come with me. Her mother would have never come. I should have defended them to the death. Thank you. That is all I wish to know. You are too hard on yourself. No one's perfect. Yeah. Accept your failings, but do not let them govern your life. You could not have known what would happen. You did what you thought was best. Mm. And what of those that follow you? Alistair, Knight, and Warden. You wonder if things would have been different if you were with Duncan on the battlefield. You could have shielded him from the killing blow. You wonder, don't you, if you should have died and not him. I... yes. If Duncan had been saved and not me, everything would be better. Mm. If I just had the chance, maybe I... Ask your question, Guardian. I am ready. You are ever the advisor, ready with a word of wisdom. Do you wonder if you spout only platitudes, burned into your mind in the distant past? Perhaps you are only a tool, used to spread the word of the Circle and the Chantry. Mm. Does doubt ever chip away at your truths? You frame the statement in the form of a question. Yet you already know our answers. There is no sense in hiding, is there? Yes, I do doubt at times. Only the fool is completely certain of himself. And you, why do you say the Maker speaks to you when all know that the Maker has left? He spoke only to Andraste. Do you believe yourself her equal? I never said that. I... In Orlais, you were someone. In Lothering, you feared you would lose yourself, become a drab sister, and disappear. When your brothers and sisters of the cloister criticized you for what you professed, you were hurt, but you also reveled in it. Mm. It made you special. You enjoyed the attention, even if it was negative. You're saying that I made it up for... for the attention? I did not. I know what I believe. The way is open. Good luck. And may you find what you seek. Was he trying to reveal, like, our deepest... like, inner secrets or deep... because... we all think that we're doing something... for someone or... Maybe the end goal is something good, but deep down there are underlying selfish reasons. And so maybe that's what he was trying to reveal, like our truest thoughts. I mean, sometimes I even doubt myself the reason why I'm doing something. Am I really doing this genuinely to help someone or am I doing it for my own satisfaction, for my own... Um, to receive platitudes from other people, the pat on the back, that sort of thing. 
um, biblically speaking, I guess if you're doing something, if you're doing something good, your right hand should know what your left hand is doing. Basically, really, if you're doing something good to be seen, and we see that a lot nowadays where people record themselves doing something good, but are you really doing it for the right reason if you're having to do it on camera? Why can't you do these things quietly? Because those who do things in quiet are rewarded openly. And those who do things openly for the the pat on the back, you've already received your reward kind of thing. So there is that question of why, the actual whys of why, the actual reasons why we do such things. Why Liliana, I don't know. Uh, that's just a thought. I uh, let's see. Urn of sacred ashes. Ashes. <laughs> Oops. Excuse me. You found brother Jenna TV. The villagers of Haven captured him when he arrived. Okay, that's oh the test of faith. Brave the gauntlet to reach the urn of sacred ashes. You need to undergo a test of faith. Guard the guardian calls this test the gauntlet. If you survive, you will have proven yourself worthy. The gauntlet is now open to you. All right. Uh, there was a book, yeah. Maybe we'll do some reading today. We'll see. The Maker's First Children. Maybe not. Maybe not do any reading today. Let's let's get through this gauntlet. I suppose. All right. I guess we'll talk to Brona. Echoes from a shadow realm. Whispers of things yet to come. Thought strange sister dwells in night, is swept away by dawning light. Of what do I speak? Can you repeat that? Echoes from a shadow realm, whispers of things yet to come. Thought strange sister dwells in night, is swept away by dawning light. Of what do I speak? Dreams. A dream came upon me as my daughter slumbered beneath my heart. It told of her life and of her betrayal and death. I am sorrow and regret. I am a mother weeping bitter tears for a daughter she could not save. Okay, so we go to the next person. Uh, the smallest lark could carry it, while a strong man might not. Of what do I speak? What? The smallest lark could carry it, while a strong man might not. Of what do I speak? The smallest something might carry it, the strongest man cannot. A tune? Yes, I was Andraste's dearest friend in childhood, and always we would sing. She celebrated the beauty of life. And all who heard her would be filled with joy. They say the Maker himself was moved by Andraste's song. And then she sang no more of simple things. Yeah. Next. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. The debt of blood must be paid in full. Of what do I speak? Oh, that's easy. Vengeance, for sure. Yes, my husband Hesarian would have chosen a quick death for Andraste. I made him swear that she would die publicly with her war leaders, that all would know the Imperium's strength. I am justice. I am vengeance. Blood can only be repaid in blood. Okay. Thanes. I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be. In this place I belong, that belongs also to me. Of what do I speak? Okay, I'm sorry, what? I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be. In this place I belong, that belongs also to me. Of what do I speak? Uh... Okay, one more. I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be. In this place I belong, that belongs also to me. Okay. Of what do I speak? Home. It was my dream for the people to have a home of their own, where we would have no masters but ourselves. The enemy of my enemy is my friend, and thus we followed Andraste against the Imperium. 
but she was betrayed. And so were we. Okay. You there? A poison of the soul, passion's cruel counterpart. From love she grows till love lies slain. Of what do I speak? Oh, can I hear that again? A poison of the soul, passion's cruel counterpart. From love she grows till love lies slain. Of what do I speak? Jealousy is the only thing that would make sense because out of love, jealousy can. If you really love somebody, though... Um, but no, let's not get too deep into it. Jealousy can definitely be my dog. <laughs> jealousy. Yeah, we'll just call it jealousy. Yes, jealousy drove me to betrayal. I was the greatest general of the Alamoni. But beside her, I was nothing. Hundreds fell before her on bended knee. They loved her. As did the Maker. I loved her too. But what man can compare with a god? So are you jealous of her or jealous of him? The bones of the world stretch towards the sky's embrace, veiled in white, like a bride greeting her groom. Of what do I speak? Uh, what? The bones of the world stretch towards the sky's embrace, veiled in white, like a bride greeting her groom. Of what do I speak? The bones of the world stretch veiled in white mountains? Yes. I carried Andraste's ashes out of Tevinter into the mountains to the east, where she could gaze ever into her maker's sky. No more fitting a tomb than this could we find. So you're talking about this place right here then? Because I mean we are in the snowy mountains. No man has seen it, but all men know it. Lighter than air, sharper than any sword. Comes from nothing, but will fell the strongest armies. Of what do I speak? What? Okay. No man has seen it, but all men know it. Lighter than air, sharper than any sword. Comes from nothing, but will fell the strongest armies. Of what do I speak? So it's intangible, right? No man can see it. So it's definitely not lightning, it's definitely not fire, definitely not a woman. So it has to be hunger. Yes. Hunger was the weapon used against the wicked men of the Teventer Imperium. The Maker kindled the sun's flame, scorching the land. The crops failed, and their armies could not march. Then he opened the heavens and bade the waters flow, and washed away their filth. I am Kefer, disciple of Andraste and commander of her armies. I saw these things done, and knew the Maker smiled on us. Okay, and last but not least... She wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants. Of what do I speak? <sighs> what? She wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants. Of what do I speak? She wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants. She wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants. Mercy? Yes. I could not bear the sight of Andraste's suffering, and Mercy bade me end her life. I am the penitent sinner who shows compassion as he hopes compassion will be shown to him. Well, there is such thing as mercy and grace. All right. Next room... My dearest child. Hello, Father? Father? <laughs> you know that I am gone, and all your prayers and wishes will not bring me back. 
No more must you grieve, my girl. This is cruel. Take the pain and the guilt, acknowledge it, and let go. It is time. You have such a long road ahead of you, and you must be prepared. And so I leave this in your hands. I know you will do great things with it. What did he just give her? What? What did he just give her? Reflection? I have no idea. It was kind of cruel. Save the game. We are saving. Gaming, game saving. We are saving. That's what I'm saying. Okay, we fight. We fight ourselves. And Alistair just knocked me down. Get the mages. Get the mages. Sorry, Wen. Oh, geez, she's strong. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm gonna die. Why wasn't I paying attention? Okay. Good to go. Okay. Juliana is. Wait, why do we? Is this sustained? Okay. Sorry about that, Natalia. I thought we were stronger than that. Oh, we don't get to loot anything in here? I see. Wait a minute. No, there's nothing in here. Alright, next. What? Uh oh. I'm terrible at puzzles. Okay. Hey, you see those thingies over on the side of that huge chasm? I bet they're used for something. Thingies. Maybe I should touch them or stand on them. Are you trying? Normal people tend to avoid strange looking sections of floor thingies, as you say. They tend to be traps. You uh, don't really think they're traps, do you? No, they definitely look like thingies that would get us across. Alistair is definitely my my character's soulmate. I think she would say thingies like me. All right, so. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> I don't think it's solid enough to stand on, but it's a start. Okay, so. Um, how do we do this? Character. How do I get you guys to? All right. Um, I don't know. Okay. Toggle. Move freely. Okay, hold position. So, this is that. That is that. What is this? That is that. That is that. That is that. And that is, okay. Oh, we're gonna be here for a minute. Let's see what this is. Uh. Okay. So what is this? All right, we're just gonna start here, I guess. I guess? No. Here? Or do we start here? No. 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 Maybe? Ooh, win. Alright, let's see. No. Mm. We'll make it across one step at a time. Okay. And here's the first step. Right. Okay. Wait. Okay, so, all right, all right, when you stay here, Liliana, um, no, there wasn't, no, 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 all right, where was that? No, no, there was one that has, like, the two. Am I, am I, like, 
Okay, I guess I'm... What? All right. Uh... I do not like these. So that's solid. We got to get the first one solid. So I need to... Okay, let me move when... I am here. When you need to go back here? No. Here. No. Here. Here. Okay. D uh. Well, who do I move? Alistair? Liliana? Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, Alright. Alistair. Uh Okay. Well who oh shoot. Who who's are you ugh, all right. When? Where are you? Okay, you've this is you. Okay. So Oh my gosh. Um me. Okay, I can't move me. So Liliana you or oh my gosh okay all right alistair you you stand here i'm so okay so if i move her okay what was that what did that what that that did nothing that did nothing what about this did that make that solid? No, it did not. It made the other one pop up. So, is this solid? No, it's not. Okay. No. 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 Yes. Alright. Next. Okay, I'm afraid to move me. Okay, so if I move me, can I move when? Can I move Liliana? What if I move Liliana? Why don't we just get one person across and go from there? Oh, I... <sighs> I screwed up. Okay, start over. Okay, so... <laughs> All right, wait. Let's go here, because it was, like, right here, right? Right. Okay, Alistair. You sit here. Right, and then... Liliana, you, you were right here, right? No, you were right here. What is that? That is nothing. No, 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 no. Okay, so you stay here. So we don't move me or Liliana. So we can move Alistair. What? We can move when. Okay. When it's it's on you, girlfriend. Cause we don't want to move Liliana. We can move me, right? Liliana's who we don't want to move. Oh, I don't it's me that I don't oh jeez. Okay. Alright. Alright. Ah, <sighs> alright. Okay, Alistair. It's okay. Where is he at? Alright. Um it was me. It's Liliana. I, I want to move. Wait. Let me look. Okay. So, is that not right? How am I lighting up? Is there another way to light this up? So if I do this, Alistair, you go here. When. What if we put... Okay. 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 Alistair, you go here. Liliana, move from here. And is... Uh, no. What was that one? Uh, oh, 
gosh. It's not... Okay. No. 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 Okay. All right, Alistair. So, who do I move? I need to remember this. All right, so Liliana is the... I feel like she's the... I'm sorry. Don't be sighing at me. I'm really trying to get this. All right, so Liliana controls... Both? Hold the phone. Can he walk across this? So what does Wynn control? She controls that. Okay, so Liliana, gotcha. All right. All right. All right. So when you got this, Liliana's standing on there, or I am. I'm doing that. So the next is this. I can move me now, maybe? Nope, I cannot. It, it was supposed to be Liliana, I think. Liliana was supposed to... No. What the what? Okay. Concentrate. So... I'm doing this wrong. I have to be doing this wrong. All right. Um, Liliana, get off your, your high horse here. And you too... All right, we're going to start over from the beginning all together. All right, so if I go over here, this lights up that. That lights up that. That lights up that as well. If I stand here, Alistair, mm, Alistair doesn't like me. How rude he is. All right, so now we've got a solid. So don't move her or her. Not right now. Now, Liliana is the one I can move. Right? That is, all right, don't move. Let me just look at Wynn real quick. If Wynn steps off, when steps off, it's that. But when, if you go here. All right, Liliana. I'm, I'm trying to figure this out. 